using your own blood to restore hair growth? Hair loss affects millions of people around the world, and it can take a toll on a person's confidence and their self-esteem. Now, fortunately, there are advances in medical technologies such as platelet-rich plasma, or PRP, that offer a way to actually restore the hair growth and reverse the effects of balding. In this video, we're gonna explore the mechanism of action of PRP in hair restoration, its advantages, its disadvantages, and everything that PRP has to offer. We're also gonna compare it to other hair loss solutions and more. So why is PRP therapy actually important? When hair follicles are well nourished, they are more likely to grow and produce healthy strands of hair. PRP is a concentration of growth factors and active proteins that are found in our own blood that can provide the nutrients your hair follicles need, leading to fuller, more natural looking hair. Now this minimally invasive treatment is a breakthrough for hair loss sufferers. To understand how PRP actually works in the body, it's important to know that platelets contain a variety of growth factors that promote healing. When we inject them into the scalp, these growth factors stimulate the hair follicles. This leads to a new patch of hair growth. PRP also increases blood flow to the scalp in the same areas, providing the hair follicles with nourishment and oxygen, almost like watering plants. Unlike other hair restoration treatments, PRP stimulates the body's natural healing process, which could provide better long-term benefits than most medicines do. So what are some of the advantages and disadvantages of PRP and hair restoration? Well, PRP has several advantages. It's safe, it's effective, there's little downtime. Because it's a non-invasive procedure, there's only minimal discomfort, and patients usually can resume their normal activities immediately after treatment. In addition, it is a viable alternative to hair transplant surgery, which can be invasive and requires a longer recovery time. However, there are some patients that are just absolutely too far gone that they need a transplant. Like any medical procedure, PRP does come with some disadvantages, however. And one of the most significant downsides is its cost, which can be high, especially if multiple sessions are necessary. And usually with PRP treatments, you would need three to four sessions over the course of several months before you see the desired results. However, most of the time, it is a pretty good solution for hair thinning, and patients don't mind the high price because of the results. The PRP injection procedure involves several steps, which can vary depending on the physician's individual practice and the equipment that they have. But it typically begins with your surgeon drawing a small amount of blood from your arm, spinning it in a centrifuge to separate the red blood cells and the plasma. Once the plasma which actually contains all the growth factors, stem cells, exosomes, is extracted, it's then injected into the scalp using a microneedle. After the injection, you can typically return to your daily activities without any downtime whatsoever. Now, what about those people who want to have hair transplant surgery at the same time? Now, PRP can be used in conjunction with hair transplant surgery to really help provide additional benefits. When used alongside hair transplantation, PRP can promote faster healing, improve the success rate of the hair grafting process, and reduce the amount of time needed for recovery. Combining PRP and hair transplant surgery will result in fuller, thicker hair growth and better results. Now, how does PRP stack up against other hair loss solutions? For the most part, it compares pretty favorably to other solutions such as finasteride and minoxidil, both of which require daily usage and have potential side effects. While PRP is a more expensive option, it usually comes with fewer risk factors and a potentially faster healing process. When compared to platelet-rich fibrin, or PRF, a similar treatment that also uses growth factors, PRP offers a higher concentration of platelets and faster release of growth factors. So in conclusion, PRP therapy offers a promising solution for hair loss sufferers looking for a non-invasive option of treatment. Knowing how PRP works in the body, its advantages, its disadvantages, and its effectiveness can really help you make an informed decision. If you're considering PRP, reach out to one of us at Genesis Lifestyle Medicine. We have 18 locations across the country. We can help you regrow that hair. Don't let hair loss affect your confidence and your quality of life. With PRP therapy, you can absolutely look and feel 
your best. Like and subscribe for more. If this helps you, share it with a friend that you know is going bald. Hit that notification button and we are uploading new videos every single week.